So There are countless the videos of alleged ghost footage on the internet. Most of them could be dismissed as poorly done edits, but on that rare occasion, you may come across a video that seems so believable, they may leave you thinking twice. Here are 10 of the most convincing paranormal videos you can find on YouTube. Number 10. Right. Tom Underwood was visiting the Gettysburg Battlefield in 2001 with his family when he recorded this video of the triangular field. It appears to show semi-transparent figures walking or flying through the woods. This is considered by many to be the best ghost video ever recorded. Oh, so shit. what do you think? Who is that? Truth? No. You moved it, right? I highly suggest you just keep recording, do not move, do not get closer, do not get further, just stay the fuck there. I really hope they just stay there. That's it. Just stay there and record. There's no reason to move forward. Please do not move forward. Oh my. Look. Look! Isn't those people? Can't be. There's no Not up in the trees. There's nobody down there no more. See? They gone, folk. Number nine. <laughs> this video has become so popular, and rightfully so, simply due to the fact that nobody can seem to explain it. Oh, shit! A Russian man's dog leads him to a truly disturbing sight. A little girl floating in the air with a woman possibly her mother, standing below, watching her as if admiring the girl's trick. What when the, the cameraman gives away his position, the camera loses sight of the girl for a few moments, and the next time she's in the shot, she's on the ground with the woman, and they run off. What? Now while this very well may be a hoax, nobody can explain how it could have been performed. The dog's behavior, mixed with a typical horrible quality camera, and the very real looking image of the girl floating, this video is definitely more convincing than others. Dazzle, come here. Oh my good, oh my shit. That looked convincing like hell. Number eight. This is another popular video. It features a man who decided to turn on his camera and get some footage of what has been making the crying noises he's been hearing in a separate room. He sneaks a peek with the camera into the room, and we see a shadowy figure sitting and facing the corner of the room crying. What? He then decides to take another look. Come on, bruh. Come on. Stop. Fuck. 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 Oh, shit. I'm getting really nervous right now, and I'm getting really scared, and I'm starting getting, I'm starting to get emotional. <sighs> okay. Just, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, hold up, bruh. Hold, okay, okay, okay. Hold on for a second. Just give me a second, people. Please. Just give me a second. Oh, my goodness. Like I said this in the one video, recent a recent video. If I get too nervous or if I get too scared, I start to get emotional. That's what that shit is doing to me. Oh, right now. Oh shit. He's fucking bullshitting with that shit. Oh, I would have hard ass like shit. Don't open that bitch. Don't. She gonna be gone. Oh! <laughs> Your late ass reaction. What the fuck? Bruh. I noticed her standing up immediately. Facing your ass. How the hell? Was your, why was your, why was your, why was your reaction so goddamn late? Huh? You bullshitting. For real, man. I can't be fucking with you. Bruh. Number seven. In this video, 
We have four kids wandering around looking for a ghost in an abandoned school in Iraq. The boys are kind of wandering aimlessly through stairwells and empty classrooms for a solid two minutes. About halfway through, while conducting another sweep of a hollowed out classroom, they seem to find what they're looking for, as a headless shadowy figure can be seen walking over to oh. the kids. Ooh. However, they don't seem to notice and continue with their search for another two minutes afterwards. <laughs> Oh, I can't. I can't. I can bitch you gotta be fucked up. The hell is that sound? What is that sound? Number six. Thirteen month old Princess Caroline, who died four hundred years ago, allegedly continues to haunt Leeds Castle in England. Her father was King Henry VIII, and the circumstances surrounding her death are controversial to this date. Her apparition was apparently finally caught on tape during a ghost hunt expedition. Bitch. 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 Number five. This is an old dash cam video from a police chase that ends with a surprise. We see the driver of the white car swerving about trying to escape the police. The police officer takes one final turn to reach a fence blocking the way. However, the driver of the white car seems to have somehow gotten through as we watch his taillights fade away down the road. In just a moment, he's going to make a turn into the twilight zone. Watch. The fence at the end means no way out, or does it? What the fuck? Number four. A couple guys are, for whatever reason, roaming in the woods of Catalonia, Spain at night with a camera on. The video cuts to a scene where the camera is zooming into what appears to be some kind of creature in a crouched position in the distance. People refer to this creature as a fallen angel. Oh. Oh, oh shit. shit. Number three. This is the recorded surveillance footage from Disneyland. If you look closely, you can see a ghostly figure walking around on different cameras. The video suggests that the ghost can walk on grass and on sidewalks without tourists present. The ghost even appears to walk on water. Some people say this is the ghost of Walt Disney himself. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Oh, ho, he just walking nonchalant, huh? You having a good time? Hmm? You, uh, you, 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 I didn't, I can't even finish that sentence. I'm so fucking creeped out. He's just, he's just walking though, like, that's crazy. He's walking, like, really nonchalant, like, like he's chilling. Like he's good, like he's relaxing. What the hell? Look here, if I was a ghost, I'd probably do that too. Just be walking all nonchalant. Number two, this is the footage recorded from a Mexican blockbuster, which catches an employee stacking DVDs, nothing out of the ordinary, oh. until this cart seems to move on its own. After that, DVDs constantly keep falling over off the shelves on their own. See? Nope. All, all it takes for me is just one time. One creepy ass time. One paranormal activity type shit. One time. That's it. You don't need to do anything else, Mr. Ghost person, thing, spirit. You don't need to do, you just need to, you just need to do one thing. That's it. One creepy ass shit and I'm out this bitch. I don't care what I'm doing. I don't, I don't, I don't care. I don't, I don't really, I don't, I don't care. I'm dropping everything and I'm just walking out. I'm hauling ass. Two or two options. That's it. The fact that you moved the cart. The fact 
that you moved the cart. That's and there's nobody else in that bitch. It just takes it just takes one time for me, then I'm out. Fuck your DVDs. Almost as if something is toying with the employee. He eventually takes off, as most people would in a similar situation. Oh uh, yeah. He must need that money bad. He must need that money bad like hell. If I put a shit, if I put a DVD on a shelf perfectly, there's, and there's no reason for it to fall, it should not fucking fall. The bitch did it twice. I'm out. You fucking, you bullshitting for real, bruh. Come on, bruh. How, how long, how many times, how many DVDs gotta fall before you fucking haul ass, huh? Oh, that's your bitch did it in your fucking face. He's just gonna nonchalantly pick it up. Are you fucking serious? Where you going? You going? You leaving? Hey, <laughs> there you go. About time. Ten years later. Number one. This video was submitted by the hotel security manager who was standing watch on September 14th, 2003 at the Wingate Hotel in Illinois. Okay. I His voice can be heard in the background of the recording. According to him, People staying at the hotel began calling in noise complaints to the front desk with reports of loud screaming coming from the second floor, right. particularly room 209. Right. There's no known history to the room according to their investigations. However, upon further review, they found that over the years, multiple complaints of strange noises were reported to be coming from that room. This is the only known recording of it. I've seen this one. I've seen this one, so I'm not gonna be. That's a nice ass pool. enjoyed this list. Some of these can definitely make you think twice about what you really believe. Man, I swear. Ooh. What the fuck? Really? <laughs> uh, uh, that's crazy. That shit did not get me. You would have thought, as much of a bitch I am, I, I probably, I didn't get, that's what I was point. A lot of, um, I, you know what? A lot of people be bullshitting, and a lot of people have don't be bullshitting. And that's me. I don't be bullshitting at all. Mm -hmm. Like, if I. <coughs> oh, shit. <laughs> You know what, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going off topic, but you know what I hate? I hate when I like breathe and some spit goes down one of my tubes. Because like everybody has like two tubes, your eating tube and then 
or like your eating slash your drinking tube, and then you have your breathing tube. I hate when fucking water when I'm drinking something on like a spit or yeah some spit gets down my fucking uh my breathing tube, bro. I feel like I'm about to die. Like goddamn. But I just want like I just want to touch on touch on something. If somebody tells me ever tells me that hey, bro, don't don't ever go in that room. There's some creepy shit in there. Okay, that's all you have to say. There's not a chance in hell I'm going to go in there. There's no reason for me to go in there. If you tell me not to go in there because it's creepy and there's some shit going down and there's uh, some spirits or it's some, it's some, you know, it's some paranormal activity stuff going on, that's enough said. That's not, you can, you can easily just, or you can just tell me not to go the fuck in there. That's it. That's it. That's all you have to say to me. That's it. All, all it takes is, all it takes is one time. One time. Fuck all that being said. Um, keep it cool. Keep it classy. And eat. Don't know why I said it like that. And I love you. Stay safe. Stay happy. Love you.